Cut a red and black wire slightly longer than your unicorn horn. Test your LED with a coin cell battery and be sure you know which leg is which. Solder a 50 ohm resistor to the anode leg and then solder a red wire to the other end of the resistor. Solder your black wire to the cathode leg. Test the LED again to make sure it still works, and then cover the joints with heat shrink. Solder a black wire to the ground pin, a red wire to 5 volt, and a white wire to the in pin on your NeoPixel ring. Trim the wires and pull them through the ring, and then solder to the Gemma. Check out our wiring guide in our full tutorial on the Adafruit Learning System for more details. To add charging capabilities, carefully cut the red wire of your battery lead and solder on a second JST connector. Repeat with the black wire. Plug your battery and charger into your Gemma and be sure everything works. Add a coil of copper tape to your 3D printed horn, making sure to leave a long tail at the bottom. Add a drop of super glue to the inside of the horn and slide the LED into the tip. Thread the battery, then the NeoPixel ring into the horn and set the charger in place. Solder the copper tape tail to the Gemma and then set it inside the horn. Turn your horn on and slip it into the 3D printed base on your headdress or costume. Check out our guide on the Adafruit Learning System for more details and be sure to enjoy your unicorn magic.